So I'm gonna see Snow White because the dwarfs are working and I'm gonna offer her my apple. Snow White, are you making an apple pie? You know the dwarfs loves apple pie. I'm gonna give you my apple. Taste it is amazing. <laughs> Snow White is gonna die and I'm gonna be the most beautiful woman of my kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> so hi everyone welcome back to my channel today after the wicked witch which is a beautiful witch i'm gonna show you how to do this uh, diabolic witch fired by snow white one so um, i'm gonna leave you to the tutorial i hope you will enjoy it and i'll see you to the next one Bye. So to start with I covered my eyebrows, I used a non-toxic glue, in this case the Prit stick. There are many ways to cover them, I showed you in many videos, so I don't want to do the whole process now because the video will be too long. So after I covered them in glue, I powdered them and covered with the concealer. Then I applied a foundation of my skin tone and powdered the whole face. Now I'm taking a black matte eyeshadow, this is from the Sleek palette, oh so special, and on an angled brush I'm just uh, tracing the shape of my brows. These, they are gonna be really cartoony, really arched and really bushy, so I'm using an eyeliner brush dipped in uh, gel eyeliner and then I swap to a liquid liner to give more three-dimensional um, shape. Now with a brown pencil I'm marking all the wrinkles on my face, I'm just creating new ones and all the expression lines and I'm making my eyes older, wrinkly and droopy, they're gonna look really hooded so that's why I dropped uh, them on the top uh, and then underneath I followed the lines of my under eyes and I created a fake bag. Then oh, I also painted some wrinkles on the uh, sides of the eyes, I accentuated the lines on the sides of my mouth and also underneath the jawline I created a dropping jawline. I'm creating cross fit wrinkles around the eyes and I also gave the face a slimmer appearance.